Hey, it's Sir Lawrence from Adamer, and today I'm going to show you how you can save yourself a little bit of money here. If you want to have a Copilot hotkey, which a lot of people are buying new keyboards because they want to have that button to hit and bring up Copilot from Microsoft. Uh, you know, Microsoft released this new key. Let me show you how, um, let me first show you some keywords that made me laugh, and then show you how easy it is to do to remap a key and auto hotkey. So, um, I found, if you Google Copilot and key, you'll see on the Amazon I mean, here we can scroll over it, and let me, let me click here, and you can see this is the key that they've added. Ooh, it's so fancy, right? Um, if you do a little research, actually, wait, before we do that, this is my favorite favorite picture here. There we go. Ooh, look at it glow. It glows. Wow, that's powerful. I'm um, sorry, it just really made me laugh. I'm like, yeah, it's real fancy. Um, so, and if you go back and search, you can see they're, they're you know, 30, 80 bucks easily, so... Just ridiculous if you know auto hotkey how easy it is and what it is you can just set up your own key combination so let me switch to first in v2 i got so here we go in toolkit i'm remapping the windows c key so the pound sign in auto hotkey is the windows key uh, and i'm going to say windows c which right now windows v is your clipboard history in windows 11 but windows c will um i am remapping it to send the left windows down the left shift and then your F23 key, and then just basically sending the shift uh, left shift up and wind, um, left windows up. So when I hit Windows C, it pops open Copilot, right? So very fast, very easy. This is the uh, V2 version. So just remember with V2 version, you need your quotes around the stuff. And if we go over to Studio, um, here you can see you don't have the quote. So it's really the same code. I just didn't put the quotes around this. So it's that easy. These are modifiers. If you didn't want it to be Windows C, you could put like the exclamation point C. This could be Alt C and it would trigger it, right? So it's that easy. It's super easy to remap keys and auto hotkey. Uh, this is one, which is kind of weird also that Microsoft created a new key, but they are remapping it to, to send these keystrokes and that is what triggers Copilot. Um, they didn't add a whole new thing. They just created it where we're like, oh, well, we'll, we'll have that trigger it's like a macro it'll trigger these and that will trigger copilot so hope you enjoyed that please like the video if it helped you hey i'll give you the links to those you can you can spend 50 bucks and have a pretty shiny key there um <laughs> let me know what you think have a great day cheers